Hello my friends, it's Crystal with Happy to Plan. I am going to be sharing with you the first week of February in my Happy Planner. So I put together a very Valentine's Day theme. Um, pretty much all of February is going to be kind of pink Valentine's Day themes. Um, and I decided that I was going to do kind of a rose and chocolate. Um, like chocolates, chocolates and roses. Um, as you can tell by the title of the video. Um, but yeah, so that's what this theme is going to be. I have a couple things I want to tell you what I'm, what I got, I pulled from. So that little picture that you see there with the poem, that picture actually came from an ideals book, um, that I had, it was like Valentine's day themed. And I really liked that little chocolate and underneath my planner, um, you'll see in a minute that there's like a little rosebud in a vase. So I'm going to cut that out. Now the rose paper came from my friend um, who used to do kits, so it's not available or anything. But anyway, I thought I would to go ahead and show you what I put together. So I started with the, paper, the rose paper and I decided that I was just going to cut little strips in the paper because the paper was not long enough to well it was long enough one way but then I don't think I would have had enough to have as many boxes as I wanted so I just did it so it was kind of just two boxes long and I did that for a couple of different ones um, and just so yeah so that's what I meant by that and then I did that for Wednesdays and then Thursday and then for Saturday and Sunday, you'll see here that I'm going to do it for the whole entire Saturday and Sunday. Um, so I'm just going to cut up the paper really quick and then show you kind of what I was doing. So when I was putting this together, um, I really had a hard time. I want to talk a little bit about sticker time while I'm doing this little section right here. I had a lot hard time finding paper that, um, I mean, stickers that went with this color theme. Um, because it was, um, def there's definitely kind of a muted pink aspect to it. I really love the color and I really love this paper and I'm super glad that I'm finally using it. Um, this one, you can see there, she has a little copyright on the doily that's sitting there that she put together for the kit. It was 1918. So, um, this, this collection was from 1918. So was, my friend used to do collections, planner collections, but she doesn't do that anymore. But, um, so anyway, I went ahead and put all those on. Now, when I put the Saturday and Sunday on there, I was like, oh, I need to do a little bit more even out on Monday. So I went ahead and picked, um, cut another piece for um, the, the little note section for Monday just to even out the two sides. Now, this video is, I was, list, I was on FaceTime with my sister while I was recording this video. And it's completely off, like you, it's not centered at all. So I do apologize for that. It's completely uncentered, and uncentered, um, even during sticker time, which is kind of just upsetting. But what can you do? <laughs> um, you can still see what I'm doing. Um, so anyway, here I am. I'm cutting out this uh, little design here that I found in that ideals book that I told you about, and I'm just gonna go ahead and do a really rough fussy cut, and then. I decided to go ahead and ink up the sides with a little red ink just to kind of make it pop off the page a little bit more. And then I also didn't like that the um, the little thing there that says like this week and the little arrow, I felt like that kind of threw it off. So what I'm gonna do is I'm going to white that little piece out and then I'm gonna stick a sticker on top of it, like a white label sticker just to cover um, all of that piece up, just so when I put down that piece, um, it kind of has like a nice clean surface to, to be on top of. So back to what I was saying about the stickers. So I had a really hard time finding stickers that were kind of in the tone that um, of this, of this the paper. Um, I eventually did find some. I went, I have a couple of different things from Carpe Diem, a couple of different sticker packs from Carpe Diem. So I was able to find some in there and then a couple other different sticker packs. So I'm just saying that just to just encourage you to like shop your stash, right? Just to 
really look at all the different stickers that you have and um, you know try to make things work even though they don't come from the same sticker line or the same sticker collection it still could work together um, because you know they're all kind of in the same tone or in this like the same color range they all can work together and um, this page is very sticker heavy I have a lot of stickers on here so sticker time was really hard to do in the little short amount of time that my little so song is because my little song is only a minute and a half so sometimes I have a hard time like squishing it all into that minute and a half but it really turned out really cute and I really love how it turned out um, and you'll see here in a second when I start sticker time that um, again the, the camera is off a little bit but you'll be able to figure out what I'm doing um, and I hope that you guys enjoyed. So I'm going to go ahead and jump into sticker time. All right, so I know this one is a really quick one, but it really did come together fairly quickly. Um, I had a lot of fun putting all these stickers on here. So that is the finished product for this week. I really love how it turned out. And then I'm gonna go ahead and flip back to last week just to show you what I did last week. Got some fun stuff happening. So um, I, I stuck that out of my book. Why did I do that? Oh, that's right. I was showing my sister that I put that sticker that says, Today I took out the trash. Um, it's one of the Dollar Tree stickers. So I was showing her that sticker. Um, I was like, Why did I take that out of my book? So, anyway, that is last week. And then we'll go ahead and flip back to this week again and lots and lots of different stickers. So I hope that you guys enjoyed. I'll see you next time.